We want to start with breaking news on the case in Kalamazoo, where police just released this photo of the man they're looking for. George Mack is his name, and police say he is armed and dangerous. Kalamazoo authorities say they think he shot and killed a man in Kalamazoo this evening. They brought out the SWAT team, thinking they had him cornered, but... He was not there. 24 Hour News 8's Heather Walker is on this story for us. She has the latest on the search and what we know about that shooting tonight. Heather, good evening. Good evening, Lynn. Yeah, police may be closer to finding that suspect. They actually took off quickly from that scene in the 1300 block of Rose. We tried to follow them, but they took off too fast. So hopefully they are closer to getting that suspect. We now know that he is wanted for fatally shooting 26 year old Edward Bell, the he who actually was found shot dead at that scene there at that home in the 1300 block of Rose. Police tell us he was visiting someone at that residence and neighbors say that he and Mac got into an argument before the shots rang out. I heard a, a door get kicked in and I just heard the gunshots. Karen Wright says she was inside her house when her stepkids ran in and said two men were arguing in front of this home. That's when she came outside and saw the commotion. All I know, I was trying to get the kids in the house. Police say the shooting happened toward the back of the home. They suspected the suspect, 26-year-old George Michael Mack, ran to a home a block over on North Burdick. SWAT surrounded the house for more than an hour until they were able to get inside and learn he was not there. Wright says she doesn't know what the fight was about, but whatever it was, wasn't worth a life. And I'm sorry that it had to end this way. Somebody lose their life. And another one going to soon lose his life. He got kids and everything. It's sad that we all, we're killing each other. We really is. Now here's another look at that suspect again. He is George Michael Mack. He's about 6'1", 150 pounds. Police say he should be considered armed and dangerous. If you have any information about his whereabouts, you are asked to call Kalamazoo Public Safety. Reporting live in Kalamazoo, Heather Walker, 24-Hour News 8. Okay, Heather, on a case that continues to develop tonight. Heather, thank you.